Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome. Please take a moment now to look around and find a closest exit in case of an emergency. Remember to silence your cell phone and any electronics to avoid a disturbance during the performance. Flash photography is strictly prohibited as it is a distraction to our performers, and tonight's program can be found electronically by scanning one of the QR codes on our music stand by any of the side doors. Enjoy the show. Good evening, Tiger Band family and friends. Welcome to the last marching band performance of our 2020 marching band season. For your safety and the safety of the Tiger Band, please keep your head, arms, legs, and feet out of the aisles as the band enters the auditorium at the beginning of the program as well as the beginning of the second half. Now it's time to sit back and relax and enjoy the pride of Cuyahoga Falls, the Marching Tiger Band, one more time.
The band open tonight show marching down the aisles to a piece that they played in their traditional tunnel entrance. It's all home performances, Eye of the Tiger. Now a selection that was played at all the band's halftime and band show performances as the band entered the field. The routine is referred to as Sides. The tune is from Tramps that released in 1976, Disco Inferno.
Now we feature our Tigerettes. They are elementary and middle school students aspiring to be in the Tiger Band. The song is one of the most played marching band songs of all time from Wilson Pickett in 1966, Land of a Thousand Dances. This next song features our Tiger and Tiger Band majorettes. It is a Bee Gees favorite from the 1977 movie Saturday Night Fever. Here is Night Fever. This next tune is played at our homecoming game as the homecoming court is introduced. This year we had five Tiger Band members on the homecoming court. Members, please raise your hand when your name is called. Sophomore attendant Dominic Campisi, junior attendant Alex Wentz, senior attendants Abby McCoy, Matthew Allport, and Maddie Rupert. The tune is the ever popular Moore.
The Tiger Band honors the brave men and women of the United States military fighting the war on terror and protecting all of us so that we may remain safe and free. Veterans and any active members of the Armed Forces, please stand when your song is played. Here is Armed Forces Salute. At this time, we will take a 10-minute intermission. Please do your best to stay out of the band hallway to your left. Gentlemen, you may use the restroom down the main hallway past the school offices at the main entrance. Ladies, your restroom is located in the hallway to your right.
This tune features our Tiger Band drum line and includes a band dance choreographed by a group of our seniors from Sister Sledge in 1979. Here is We Are Family. At this time, we will recognize the senior class of 2024. As the senior is recognized, he or she will receive a rose compliment of the junior class. Please hold your applause and appreciation until all seniors are recognized. Matthew Allport, son of Wendy and Tom Allport. <laughs> Genevieve Onspach. Daughter of Mark and Angie Onsba. Dylan Baker, child of Jonathan Baker and Sharon Collier. Andy Ball, son of Scott and Nicole Ball. <laughs> Gavin Ball, son of Susie Rupert and John Ball. Rennie Booth, daughter of Candace Booth. <laughs> Isabella Crabtree, daughter of Gary Crabtree, stepdaughter of Heather Crabtree. Caitlin Dack, daughter of Michaeline Dack and Jeremy Dack. Janessa Delmark, daughter of Casey Hughes and Patrick Delmark, stepdaughter of Heather Delmark. Joey Dodge, son of Ken and Cindy Dodge. 
Jacob Duve, child of Andrew Duve and Stephanie Smith. Alexander Eagleton, son of Scott and Tammy Eagleton. Jaden Fornash, son of Larry and Melissa Fornash. Katie Fox, daughter of Cecilia Fox. Aiden Gorman, son of Stephen and Rochelle Gorman. Chloe Grove, daughter of Rosalie and Robert Grove. Noah Height, child of Tim Height and Megan Height. <coughs> Lillian Ng, daughter of Victor Ng and Wendy Woodburn. Audrey Keenan, daughter of Nancy Kogan Keegan, Keegan and, son, and Scott Keenan. Elena Kilker, daughter of Kathleen Kilker. Abby McCoy, daughter of Mindy Durst and Greg McCoy. Skylar Misroon, daughter of Stephanie Leslie and Ben Misroon. Eva Montoni, daughter of Amy Martinez and Mike Montoni, stepdaughter of Melissa Miller. Madison Nipper, daughter of Evangeline Evangela and Michael Nipper. Dominic Pierman, son of Tracy and son of Tracy Stewart and Sean Pierman. Kelsey Ray, daughter of Gail and Cliff Ray. Maddie Rupert, daughter of Michael and Mary Rupert. Ethan Sackett, son of Brady Sackett. Holly Sonier, daughter of Lori Sonier and Daniel Sonier. Madison Scott, daughter of Lisa Scott. Elizabeth Selvers, daughter of Kelly and Gary Selvers. Bobby Shaddix, son of Jeremy and Becky Shaddix. Ale Alexander China, son of Jared China and Sarah Gary. <laughs> Brennan Tear, son of Rachel and David Tear. Nathan Wilson, son of Lisa and Brian Wilson. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the Tiger Band Senior Class of 2018. Senior class, please stand for the playing of the Chicago Falls on Mutter under the direction of Miss Courtney Lambert.
This next song is this year's senior song. It was last played in their freshman year of 2020. It is from the band Sticks from their album Pieces of Eight. Blue Man, Blue Collar Man. So thank you to the IMP board. Um, another part of um, this organization, which is very important, is our uniform um, parents. Um, those people um, spend a lot of time making sure that the kids um, are fitted in the uniforms, um, making sure that if there's a repair that's needed, that they let us know so that we can get that taken care of. Um, doing all the things that need to happen to make sure that they have what they need, not only for marching band, but for concert band as well. Um, those people are Patty Lovell, Michelle Davis, Nancy Keenan, Mary Barker, Cindy Dodge, and Karen McDaniels, um, in addition to anybody else that helped over the summer um, fit the kids, because that was a much larger team of people, and I don't really have all their names, but if you helped with uniforms, we definitely appreciate it. So thank you to those people. And always, um, we are looking for more people to help it, it, it with specifically that crew because that is a very big job. So anybody who's willing to volunteer to help us with the uniforms, we would gladly um, accept your help. Um, our next group of people, um, the alumni band here I mean, Cuyahoga Falls is a very um, strong um, and healthy organization. Their president is Mark Bowers, and we definitely appreciate all the work and effort that they do. Um, if you're an alumni band member, I think they're in the section over there, please stand up and be recognized. Any member of the alumni band, <laughs> I want to see these people. 
people because I'm always looking for them when it comes Memorial Day or the 4th of July or time for the band show so that I know who I'm looking for. But we definitely appreciate all the work that they do and the support that they give uh, the current Tiger Band. So we definitely appreciate our alumni and um, especially Mark Bowers, who's the president of the Alumni Association. So thank you, Mark. Someone else that has been with us for the past few years um, is doing an outstanding job. The person that does all of our video, videoing of the band and all the games, um, band shows, and this event as well is Mr. Tanner Martin, who is also an alumni of the band. So thank you, Tanner Martin. And of course, um, Mr. John Wade, the voice of the Tiger Band. Thank you for the opportunity. So I have to keep asking. So, Mr. Wade, is this year number 31? Correct. Correct. I got it right this time. So, 31 years. Yes. And the best part of that, I, I have to say this, and I know if some of you know what I'm going to say already. He's had perfect attendance, and I'm not. I'm not kidding. He's been in every band show, every football game, home and away. He's even been on band trips with us, but he has been with us for 31 years and never, ever missed, ever. Um, I would also like to thank our auditorium manager, Lucas Fry, who makes all this possible for us. Thank you, Mr. Fry. <laughs> stage crew kids, and then this is kind of a new thing in the last couple of years, but all the members that are, um, all the stage crew people that are in band, please stand. It's, it's a lot. Yeah. That's good. And again, those kids, if you're in band, you know how to move stuff, so that's a great asset to have when you're on stage crew. So Mr. Fry, you've got some of the best kids in the school for sure. Yeah. Awesome. Oh, you can sit down now. <laughs> um, the other uh, thing is that I have um, additional staff people that we have that work with the kids and help us facilitate some of the stuff. Um, one person that's here tuning the drums all the time, which it, our drum line is huge this year. It's, Ms. Lambert, is it 22 people or is it more? I don't know, it's, it's over 20. We have a lar the largest drum line we've had in a long time. So Mr. Rob Hassing is constantly tuning the drums and that is a very time consuming piece. <laughs> Additionally, we'd also like to thank Mr. Zach Warren, who is our trombone instructor, who does a great job with our trombone section. Thank you, Mr. Warren. And of course, we definitely would like to thank our major advisor, Ms. Brianna Lampa. She does a great job with the girls. Um, I would also like to thank uh, Mr. Craig Humphreys, who is one of our assistant directors. He's here. Mr. Humphreys is new to our team this year. Um, he and I actually went to college at Akron U a long time ago, and we're in the marching band there together. But we definitely appreciate having him on board with one of, uh, as one of our assistant directors with the Tiger Band. So thank you, Mr. Humphreys. <laughs> and last but not least, Miss Courtney Lambert, who I could not do any of this without her. <laughs> collect myself here for a second. <laughs> anyway, no, I, I do appreciate, I mean, I'm, I'm very fortunate to be able to work with somebody who is one of my best friends and just a talented musician and just a pleasure to work with every day, so thank you. Okay, now we're on to some fun stuff, okay? Uh, we're going to do some band cheers. Um, the band um, does a lot of band cheers. We try to add a couple every year, but again, it's one of those things where we have so much music to memorize 
and it's it's a lot, but we definitely try to squeak in a couple new ones every year, um, and then obviously keep some of the same ones that are crowd favorites. So, band, we're going to start with um, band chair number two. Okay, go ahead and hit it.
Okay, now we're going to feature our symbol line. So symbols come on down the front here. This is a, a drum cheer called Black Gold, which features our symbol line. Okay, this next one is yet another drum cheer. This is three, one, two.
and this one's going to be Night on Bald Mountain. This next one is a new one, and it's going to feature our trombone section, so trombones come on down. It's entitled, well I'm not going to tell you, you'll know what it is, I hope you know what it is. tuba section, so come on down tubas. All 11 of them. Maybe next year we'll have 12. I'm just killing me that we don't we'll see one more. <laughs> okay, tubas, are you ready? Here we go. Thank <laughs> you. 
Tomorrow evening, the band and their families will have our annual band banquet here in the high school cafeteria. Dinner's at 6 o'clock with dessert following. The evening will conclude here in the auditorium with presentation of awards and a slideshow. Next, we feature our Tiger Band dancers in the tune from Donna Summer in 1979, Hot Stuff. This next tune includes some audience participation. Feel free to join with us in this Village People Classic from 1977, YMCA.
Thank you for supporting our 2023 Marching Tiger Band. Please support our concert bands in their concert season that begins tomorrow. We conclude our show with an all-time Tiger Band performance written on Christmas Day in 1896 and by an act of Congress in 1987 and is now the National March of the United States. Featuring our flutes and piccolos and John Philip Sousa's Stars and Stripes Forever. <laughs>